Great Scott. Great Scott. Great Scott. Hello, everyone, and welcome to this strange edition of Great Scott. I'm Scotty B, and thanks for watching. So, as we've said on the Superman homepage in the last couple of days, you can really not look anywhere without someone doing the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. What the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge is, for those who are uninitiated, is you take a bucket of ice water and you dump it on your head, all in the name of um, letting people know about this ALS disease and uh, uh, in general how it affects people. It uh, kind of paralyzes them to a certain extent, which is something similar to what you get momentarily when you have ice water pour in your head. But you can go to ALSA.org or ALS.com, find out more information, find out how you can donate, and find out how you can help to find a cure or at least a manageable treatment for this disease. The reason I'm doing Great Scott on this today is because I've noticed that Zack Snyder, Ben Affleck, and Gal Gadot have done the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge, but I haven't seen anything from Henry Cavill, Amy Adams, or Diane Lane. Now, it shouldn't be difficult for Amy Adams because in Enchanted, she had to film a scene in the rain for many, many hours, you know, on set when you're filming, especially when you're filming in something like a strange weather situation where they have to set up weather machines and they have to make it seem like it's raining. You are getting wet and you're out there for 16 hours sometimes, you know, 15 hours, 20 hours, if they're lucky, 10 or 12 hours. But Getting wet shouldn't really be a problem. Diane Lane, I tried to look. It seems to me that in Streets of Fire in 1984, she was in a rain scene as her and the lead protagonist are wet, standing out in the street, hugging each other in some of the promo posters that I saw. I watched some footage from the movie and couldn't actually see uh, a rain scene, but I didn't watch the whole film, so I'm going to guess that being an actress, she's been in a rain scene or been wet at one time or another. And uh, the third person, obviously, is our man, Henry Cavill. Um, we know that he, uh, in the promo shot for Batman v Superman, is standing in Gotham City, uh, apparently, in the rain. So I'm sure he got wet while he was filming that scene. <clears throat> or they just added the rain post effect after. But I'm sure he's brave enough that he can handle a little bit of uh, water poured onto his head. now. I've heard from uh, several fans, and I also looked up on YouTube. There are apparently lots of people who have called out Henry Cavill, and um, I'm just going to add my voice to theirs. Uh, most of us are just fans. We've, we've never really met these people. They're not our friends. So I'm not sure what the rules are. I think you're supposed to call out people that you know. Uh, I did meet Henry Cavill. <laughs> uh, I did not meet Diane Lane, and I saw him. Adams when we were at the Man of Steel after party after we saw the show, the big show, on uh, June 10th of 2013. <clears throat> so, if Henry Cavill remembers, uh, we met, we had a little picture for the Superman homepage, and I think this is all for a good cause, so your fans would love it, uh, all three of you, if we could see the Ice Bucket Challenge as performed by fantastic Superman celebrities, I'm sure they can do it better than anyone else. Uh, thanks everybody for watching, and remember, um, Steve Eunice, I'm calling you out as well. <laughs> Here we go. This is my bucket, Ooh, filled with ice and with water. <laughs> you, well, I'll give you more time than 24 hours because who knows if you're going to see this. Simon Blakemore, uh, one of the Superman homepage fans, also had this idea and has done the ice bucket challenge, calling out Gal Gadot and Henry Cavill. But Gal had already done hers, so Henry, uh, Simon, myself, and lots of other fans have done this call. So, great Scott! Do it already! Whoa! Whoa, great Scott! Whoa, we look up in the sky!